We are so glad that you're with us here at 530. I'm Carolina Lee. And I'm Dave Wagner. In for Josh, Courtney as well. First, as we count down to Election Day right here, we're just 11 days until the day. Uh, we want to know what you care about. 10 Tampa Bay reporter Liz Crawford took your tough questions to the two congressional candidates running for the newly drawn District 14, which now includes Tampa and St. Pete. Democrat Kathy Castor has held the seat since 2007, but Republican James Judge hopes to unseat her next month. Number one, was the 2020 presidential election stolen? We, we have enough time for this question, <laughs> uh, for this answer? Um, no, but there are some caveats. And I, what I'll explain is, look, I don't know what happened in the 2020 election, but I do know that like every election, there's cheating in every election, unfortunately. Um, was it enough to overturn the race? I don't believe so. And I'll give you my reasoning for believing that. Uh, I make phone calls to people every single day for the campaign purpose. And when I talk to one out of three Republican women that tell me that they couldn't vote for President Trump because he just was too vulgar, he was too aggressive and too brash, um, I think that when you lose that much of your base that the election wasn't stolen. Next is from Anka Garcia. What is your stance on Ukraine? Here's my take on it. If we had strong leadership in Washington, if we had good foreign policies, I don't think that Russia would have invaded Ukraine. Under what conditions would you support direct American military action to support Ukraine against Russia? If um, any. I think that one, I would like to speak to our military leadership in terms of really before I like answer that question and say, okay, I'm gonna, you know, we need to do this, we need to do that. I'd like to actually get a briefing and understand where they feel on things and what they think our readiness capabilities are. Do you support women's right to choose and what happens to her body so this question right is is one that um has been asked a lot this campaign and it is so much more complicated than pro-life pro-choice how do we how do we have a law that is fair and balanced on all sides um so I think that, that maybe there's a definition where we have like a heartbeat law where when there's a heartbeat um we judge a death by a heartbeat why not judge a life by a heartbeat? What are maybe one or two actions that you would support to control the flow of immigrants coming across uh, the southern border? Immediately, this is a, a foreign policy issue all day long. I mean, there's one we have to start enforcing law, and we should beef up border security. We should uh, finish the wall. Liz Crawford, 10 Tampa Bay. And we want to let you know you can download the free 10 Tampa Bay Plus app for Fire TV and Roku devices to view extended interviews with the candidates. We're going to have Liz's conversation with incumbent Democrat Kathy Castor. That's coming up on 10 Tampa Bay at 6.